Porn's value probably peaked at 18. Yeah, you would think that an uh, 18-year-old, fresh off the boat, never really been touched, would probably be more valuable. If you feel like you're too old and the work is too daunting and you don't know where to start, those are three powerful EEQs. How can I move beyond the fear and limitation about my age? Just asking that question challenges your mindset around your age. And you asking that question helps you to see that you are bringing your age to the table. And if you feel like age is an issue, then do yourself the favor of, you know, you're probably scrolling in uh, through social media anyway. Come to my page. <laughs> see, see what an older woman is getting done. You know, you have made assumptions about age that limit you. So that idea of empowered to choose how you respond, you are responding to age like it's a problem. What happens if you respond to age like it's a gift? What happens if you respond to age and, you know, step into the parts of you that are rich because of your age? What happens if you begin to see how much your age has given you and how, what it has given you, whatever wisdom it's given you, whatever discernment it's given you. I mean, there is something, y'all, there is nothing more mm, gratifying, I would say, than to stand in front of someone who is being whomever they're being and have your gut, you be have such a good relationship with your gut that you know that this person is not one of your people, that you need to take what this person is saying with a grain of salt. There is nothing more exciting than being able to trust your gut in that way. So hopefully you've learned something that you appreciate with age, lean into it. And if you haven't, then ask the EEQ, how do I begin to see my life as just starting? How can I create my best life starting right now? What must I do? to have this place that I'm in be the starting point of something better than I could have ever imagined. It just shifts your perspective and allows you to open to your possibilities that are being limited, not by the world out there, because there's way too many examples on YouTube and Instagram for your perspective to be the truth. It's just your perspective. So we got to take responsibility for our perspective, right? If there's a thousand people who, you know, are living life according to your perspective and you can find one who isn't, pay attention to the one. <laughs> if you if you want to go somewhere, pay attention to the one because the others are seduced and hypnotized by the same stuff that you are. But there's a whole bunch of people who are not living your limitation. Get curious about those people. How is it that how, what are they thinking that allows them the freedom that I can't see? And what must I need to see so that I can invite more freedom into my life? You see how that's like taking responsibility? It's like, no, life doesn't just, you know, bump up to, against you and say, this is how it has to be. Life bumps into you and you go, oh, this is how I'm seeing it.
These are the assumptions and conclusions I am drawing about myself and about my life. And every single one of them becomes a, you know, a rod in the jail that I create that holds me small. Now you take responsibility for that, right? You go, oh my, I'm doing that. You mean I can change that? Yeah, you can change it. You mean I don't have to think the way I'm thinking? No, you don't have to think the way you're thinking. You think the way you think because it's been a habit up until now. But from this point forward, it can be an EEQ. How can I do it differently? What does that look like? It can be curiosity. What does that look like? It can be imagination. Well, what I really want is this, 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 and this, and then name it, write it down, put it in your journal, write it on your mirror, revisit it over and over and over again. That's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want. Driving down the street, look for the people who are living the life that you like. Look for the, look for that fly woman, you know, who is, you know, got an outfit on and you're going, oh my God, she looks good. Oh my God. Oh my God. That woman is the age that I thought was too old. I'm loving you. <laughs>